So hey guys, this is Miss Motivation coming at you with another video. You guys have been waiting on this video. I have had requests and so I'm just going to give you what you've been asking for. First, before we start the video, <clears throat> if you're not a subscriber to my channel, please subscribe to the channel. Hit the bell on the side for notification so that you can get every video, everything that I put up and out. And make sure that you leave a comment give me a thumbs up and repost this video if you find it helpful and you think that it would help somebody and if you know somebody that is on a healthy weight loss journey or healthy journey long term and you feel like that this video will help so now let's get into the video so we have had requests for 310 um, videos on this shake to because you guys want to spice up the flavor you're not liking what it's tasting like it's bitter um, it tastes um, planty whatever different comments different people different taste buds however there are different things that you can do to make the drink taste a lot better um, even though I like it but what you have to do is find the flavor that you actually like like I said last time you have the mocha you have the mocha chia you have I mean um, you have mocha you have vanilla you have vanilla and chia you have chocolate and you have strawberry my favorite I like the strawberry is good by itself nothing else mixed in it maybe a couple of strawberries but vanilla is my actual fla um, flavor and my favorite flavor because you can do a lot of things with the vanilla remember first of all that this drink by itself is only 90 calories and um, with that being said if you're substituting a meal then you can add and it's not going to really bother the meal substitution because there's no meal that you have that is only going to be 90 calories okay none I don't know any of them so um, and no calories no fat just a little bit of sodium a little bit of potassium um, seven carbs fiber and um, you've got a good amount of protein 15 grams so now for this one this recipe this time this is what you will need I have two medium to large size strawberries um, just like a palm full of blueberries not a whole lot maybe about eight and you get a handful of spinach or if you really want to get technical it's about a half of a cup this is actually a cup but it's not really full and then I have a chunk of ginger just to make it a little spicy and um, that's about it oh and my almond milk last time we used water today we're going to use almond milk okay and of course you got your 310 cup and you have your 310 shake mix and um, I have this because per cup it's 80 calories and I want to kind of measure out and figure out how many calories I'm adding to this for you guys and also for my sake so let's get into it and you need your blender of course make sure you got your blender you can use the ninja or you can use your um, What's the other one? The bullet. I want to get one of those because those are very quiet, actually. These are loud, but since you guys is asking for this video, you know I got to do it for you. Okay, so first I'm going to do this. I'm going to just do one of these so far. This is a cup. And then we're going to do this. And of course, I always told you I don't use the whole cup. Even though it says use the whole cup, I don't. Because you don't, I don't know. I just don't need to have it all. That. So I'll put that in there, spread it around. And so what we're going to do, and you may want to do this before you start, but I want to do it because I want to see how many I'm going to need. I think basically two cups. Okay, so two cups, 
will actually make that is a little bit over it is over it's uh, almost 12 ounces okay so you got two cups 12 ounces so the other three ounces we're going to use just a little bit of warm water only for this to be able to dissolve okay And so what I'm going to do is use a half of a cup, pour that in there, let it sit, warm water, boom, that's done. Let that sit a little bit. And we're going to go ahead and pour the almond milk, nice creamy almond milk, delicious. A little handful of blueberries, boom, 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 strawberries, put that on top, it ain't gonna bother you, okay, palm pool of spinach, maybe a half of a cup of spinach, and your ginger, okay, and even though it's not lunch time for me yet, this is gonna be a lunch substitution, or you can do it for supper, or you can have it for breakfast, however you want to. But since the video is late starting, then it's lunch, almost supper time for some of those. Okay? So let's do that. It's in here, and we're ready to blend. Power on. Medium. the last time the water we did the same amount but we used only water last time and it, the cup filled up to the top almost overflowed this time I guess it's a little bit different because you're not getting as much film with the milk even though you would think you would probably get the film with the milk instead of the water but for some reason we got it with the, the water instead of the milk so we're just going to test it, see what it tastes like. Mmm. Now that's, that's delicious. I like that one better than the last one, I think. I think only because the almond milk gives it a little bit of kick, I think compared to the water. Now, if you're not really into, um, if it doesn't really matter, then you can do the water or either. The water's probably better. You're taking in less calories. This is going to be like 160 calories. And, um, let me see. No, this is going to be 260 calories. 
No, I'm lying. Wait a minute. That's going to be 250 calories because you got 90 and then you got 160 that you're adding. You might add that up right. <laughs> yeah. Either or. You, you can figure it out. But anyway, so two strawberries, a palm full of um, blueberries, a teaspoon of flaxseed, and a half of a cup of spinach. And your 360 shake, not full. I mean, I don't use the whole thing. And it tastes delicious. So, if you tried the last shake, I want you to put down in the comments that you tried the last shake. Tell me what you thought about it. That was the one with the dragon fruit and spinach and ginger. This one this time is strawberries, <laughs> strawberries, blueberries, ginger, spinach, and some flaxseed. So, let me know what you think. I really think you're going to like this one. This is really good. If you haven't um, tried either one of these, you ought to try the gingerbread cookie shake that I made the last time, which is not a lot of calories at all and hardly no fat. So you're still able to substitute a meal with that and get away with it, and it's still going to be healthy and nutrition, nutritious for you, and you're still going to be able to lose the weight that you desire. Just don't overdo it. You see, everything in moderation. You don't need... 17 strawberries and uh, 100 blueberries to make one cup of a drink that you're making you know your 15 ounces so do it in moderation and you'll have plenty that will last and of course um, this will last the work everything will work together just do it in moderation i love you guys this is miss motivation i hope you enjoyed this video like i said if um you tried the last shake that um, we made together let me know what you thought about it if you try this one let me know if it's something that you don't have then do just strawberries and spinach if you want to try that um if you got flaxseed and strawberries do that or flaxseed and blueberries whatever you got try it tell me what you think but this one with the almond milk, really, if you haven't tried the almond milk with your um, 310, go get you some. Try it. I think you'll really enjoy it. You can get coconut milk, almond milk. They have different ones, even rice milk. Um, but so far, my favorite has been the almond. So, it's either that or skim. And I love skim milk. So, um... Tell me what you think, guys. I love you. This is Miss Motivation. I'm out. Stay passionate and positive in everything that you do. And I'll see you in my next video. Bye.